Hello there, dear guests. My name is Manda Panda, and welcome to a little visual novel indie game called You Left Me. Now, this has been sitting in my itch.io collection for a little while, and I've just really been wanting to play it, so here it is. Um, as you can tell by this wonderful um, opening screen we're getting, I was drawn to the art style immediately, and it just looked really beautiful and really interesting. And also not too long, it said that there are five different endings and each playthrough is about five to thirty minutes, so I wanted to see how far I could get. Um, another thing is that this video, uh, or this, this game, excuse me, does deal very heavily with such matters as suicide and depression, so if you are sensitive about such topics, I would highly suggest clicking out of this video now, because uh, apparently from the things I read, this does deal quite heavily in areas such as that, as those. So just be forewarned, those of you who keep watching. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start. 5-16-2018, am wake up. I gotta click it, I guess. 5-16-2018, work. 5-16-2018, sleep. 5, 17, 2018, 7, 11, wake up. Who wakes up at 7, 11? Like, that specifically. I wake up in the same bed, but a different world. Where am I? Why am I here? This is gorgeous, I can already tell. Cat? I want to talk to the cat, I can't. Oh. Moon? On the moon clicks a 12 hour timer. Okay. What what happens when night falls and time runs up? How do I get out of here before then? Oh, there are things. My phone, unseen uh unseen text miss calls. Or I guess that's supposed to be like no or something. Like that. I rarely look at my phone anymore. I try to forget about the memories it contains. Talk to Moon, get out of bed, do nothing. In the words of SpongeBob, many hours later. Cat? <gasps> cat! It's a Cyclops cat! Oh my god, that's so adorable. You gave me this cat. I love him like you had. Around him, I feel comfortable. No need to pretend. Hmm. Something doesn't seem right. But I can't remember how he looks up close. I haven't spent time with him, not since. Um talk. Hello, uh, Moo? Wow, what did I name my cat? I had him for a while now, yet I can't remember. His name is Untitled. Oh yeah, Untitled. I'm pretty proud of that one, thought of it myself. Hey, Untitled, you pee everywhere, but I love you anyways. Mood, honestly. Moo Moo Bork. My dude, you're awake. Good snug last night. Uh, let's let's give him a little scritchy. Burf burf. Will you marry me platonically? I love you. Thank you. Pat. Burf, 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 burf. Ah. I love that. That's that's awesome. Mom, I stand. <laughs> nice. Yeah. I heart. You too. Moo 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 yeah. You're leaving already? Okay, I love you. Please come back soon for purse and snugs. That's, that makes me happy. Oh my gosh. Okay. 11 out of 10. Best game of the year. Fridge. Uh, read notes. White magnets read... <laughs> Waffles B. No, I'm kidding. Um, can you turn this down a little? That turns it off, never mind. They read, they read. Hope the heckin' pan. I'm trying, but I can't read them all. I see words, mind, but I don't understand what they mean, a mess. Uh, it, I don't know what's going on. I feel like my mind is working against me. It can't focus. It can't stop thinking about horrible things. I feel like I'm going crazy. 
No one should be scared of failure. You only learn from it. After a few attempts, I get it. How does the pancake wobble? The magnets ask. The lifelong question. The first sticky note reads, Daily reminder, I love you. From you know who, not the Harry Potter kind. The second note reads, Remember Swain's Lane? Why? The third note reads, Give this girl some milk. Milk. That's enough fridging for today. Okay. Um, can I f look inside? There we go. I'm positive there's nothing. Look anyway. I find my keys in the freezer. I thought I'd put them in my pocket. How did they get there? Did I put them there? Need to get my memory checked. That's enough fridging for today. Um, the moon rumbles. How do you round up 37 sheep? Round it to 40. Did you take a shower today? Don't forget to return it. The moon chuckles at their own joke. You've forgotten so much. Um. Okay, I don't want to look at my phone. Got it. Can I get out of bed? Ooh, that's pretty. Where do I go? I need to escape this world before time runs out. Uh, clinic? Oh. That's not creepy at all. Their mouths are moving, but I can't hear anything. Um, wait in line, I guess? I wait for a very long time. Um, as I was just beginning to lose hope, they called my name. Sorry about the wait. Our latest experiment in happiness didn't go quite as well as we planned, so I had to do some crisis intervention. Enough about me. What can I do for you today? Uh, I think I've lost my mind. Hmm. Perhaps you're experiencing head trauma. I can do a brain scan for you if you'd like. I'd like that. Alright, hold on. I really like this already. Hello, ma'am. Results came back and your brain looks perfectly healthy. But my memory isn't working. Hmm. Hmm, I might have a solution for you. We just invented them in the labs. We're calling them happy pills. Did you take your joy today? A pill a day should keep the herd away. Um, I have doubts. They'll be here for you, yours for the taking, anytime you feel a little unhappy. Um, my mask is cracking. It looks fine to me. It's not working. Yes. The happy mask cannot cover for all sad scenarios. Perhaps something happened recently? Nothing happened. Excuse me, can you repeat that? How do I get out of this world? Sorry, I'm not trying to help you with that. Signs of psychosis, possible insanity. Oh, don't mind me, I'm just taking notes. Did you need anything else? Well then. Give up and go home, I guess. Forget the clinic. It's useless. They can't fix my pain with pills and injections. Even if they could, I'm too scared to let them in. To let anyone try. Oh. Wow, that's beautiful. I'm too scared of trusting to... Of trusting than being left bereft again. Um, escape? I can't do anything. What, what happened? Oh. But I don't, I don't want to die. Oh. Okay, so I guess that was an ending? Uh, that was interesting. I liked it. Let's um, let, let's go again. Let's go one more time. But this time I want to turn the music down a little bit. There we go. So <clears throat> I see that uh, this is also dealing with um, like medication and such. Did not know that either. Hmm. The moon rumbles. Is there anything else he's gonna say? Let's see. Oh, he said crap. He said something else, and I forgot. 
What do you call a man with no nose and no body? Nobody knows. I love that joke. I know it's been hard. What's loud and sounds like an apple? An apple! <laughs> I like that. I know you want to give up. Um, let's look at my phone. No, I don't want to look at the phone. Uh, let's talk to the moon. What class did Karl Marx struggle with the most? The bourgeoisie. <laughs> I love that. That's nice. <laughs> talk to the moon. What's brown and rhymes with Snoop? Dr. Dre. <laughs> That's great. I love that. Okay, one more. Do you feel alone? Oh, that was more depressing than the other ones. Okay, one more. What do you call a dog that does magic tricks? A labracadabra door. <laughs> I love puns. They're the highest form of humor. And if you disagree with me, please unsubscribe. I'm just kidding. Please subscribe. Oh my god. Um, let's go to work. Oh, this looks fun. Very productive. Uh, talk? Do I have to socialize like a few full functioning humans? <laughs> Yesterday you said that tomorrow. Oh hey, what's up? Why are you at work today? Uh, why do you ask? I mean, I just, why are you here? You've been taking this day off for weeks now. Ever since, I mean, yeah. Anyway, why are you here? Um, I just wanted to. You wanted to? You okay? You right in the head? Uh, it's not like it matters. I'll forget whatever I'm doing right now in a few hours anyway. Bro, <laughs> I think you should really talk to someone. Bumbling of emotions just isn't, you know. What do you mean by that? I mean, you've been to high gates, haven't you? I don't know. My memory has not been cooperating lately, so I have no idea. Oh, uh, guess I'm sorry to hear that. I just wanted to say I can go with you if you go. I know from experience that the first time is the scariest. Thank you, I appreciate your kindness. For sure, my dude. We rarely talk, but you're pretty chill. You should hang out we should hang out sometime. Catch you later. That was nice. I, I appreciated that person. Um, let's go to the roof. Oh. That's a thing. That's I like that. That's really cool. Eavesdrop. It's nice to meet you. I'd like to introduce you to Martha. She Oh, okay. Well, that's just, we know how that's gonna end. Um. Go back to work. Report. Oh. Hello there. Hello, friend. A decent job, as always. Of course, there's always room for improvement. Hey, what do you say about, what did, what do you say about working late tonight? You can improve and I can give you closer feedback. I don't want to improve at packaging boxes. This is a great opportunity for you. Trust me on this. Um, Alright, thank you. Fantastic, you won't regret this. I end up working six hours overtime. The work and its dull mundane glory allowed my thoughts to fester. I can't stop thinking about it. Oh, oh. I can't stop thinking about it. 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 Stop thinking. I want to stop thinking. Help me, please, make it stop. Well, this, uh, is a lot more relatable than I thought it would be. Uh, look outside? I hadn't noticed before now. Every day the bus passes the same flower field. You would have liked this. Oh, that's, wow. I wish I could show this to you. Um, anywhere. I'll go anywhere. I don't care where, as long as it's far away from home. Hours pass. I don't know where I am. I don't know why I'm here. 
I used to have fun taking the metro together and leaving at random stops. Without you, there is no fun. Without you, repeating old memories just makes me feel lost. Oh. By the end of the adventure, I felt like a little of my soul had... I had left a little of my soul to every place I visited. The park, a hill, inside rooms, outside buildings, noisy streets, soft smoke and alleys. Night, night, night finally falls. When I get back on the bus to head home, no one is there. The loneliness is suffocating. Oh. Can I not? I'd like to not do that. Uh, Swain's Height. I remember now. I died a while ago, and I've been denying it since. You wouldn't want that, would you? Me, stuck in my head, living a fantasy? When there's so much more of reality to explore? The cat you left me? The flower fields that pass the metro? I loved you, you know. You left me behind. I don't blame you for leaving. Every day I wake up and think about joining you. Jeez. Oh, wow, okay. Um, this is really upsetting, but I really love this. Okay. Um, you have to survive. You can't let it overtake you. But I'll keep living with the memories you gifted me. Without you. Five sixteen twenty eighteen eleven twenty four PM Live End Dedicated to everyone who's lost anyone. Thank you for playing. Wow. Well that was a thing. Um I really enjoyed that. Um I might go back and play the rest of the endings and or try and get the rest of the endings, we'll see. Um, but, yeah, suicide is real. It is a real problem that people deal with. So is depression. And as many people try to deny that, it just makes it worse. Um, if you are struggling with things, you need to talk to someone, whether it's a doctor or just a friend or a family member. And whoever sees this, I hope that you can comment down below and just vent to me. Because I'll read what you post, and maybe I won't reply, but, you know, at least I'm listening. At least I'm here for you. Um, and if I do reply, then, well, at least I'm going to try and help. <sighs> Life is worth living, and it's good, and good things are coming. Better days are ahead, and there is a light at the end of the tunnel, eventually. You just have to keep holding out and hoping that it will be better, because things do get better. I love you all, and I hope you all have a good day, and I will see you all very soon. Bye-bye.